guess what? I've got good news for you. Do you remember the um, uh, video I made, um, LHC Satan Stargate 2008, and how much ridicule I got for that? Do you remember? I mean, I got called some amazing names, names that I didn't know existed. Now, for every single person out there who abused me, and there were thousands that actually did so, you're about to be gutted. I love the BBC. I was watching um, BBC iPlayer um, a little bit earlier on. Now, one thing that I said in, in, um, in the Satan Stargate uh, video was that it was impossible for the LHC to produce black holes. And I got all of these um, messages abusing me and telling me that I don't know nothing about science and that all of the scientists at CERN cannot possibly be wrong and that I would be right. Well, you better sit down. Um, I'll just press this little button here on my computer. And there's a story about the LHC on the BBC News and it says... It's one of science's biggest experiments costing billions of dollars. Some people feared it could cause black holes. Of course, that was a fallacy. Oh dear. Unfortunately, days after opening, the Large Hadron Collider just outside Geneva developed faults and had to be shut down. So there you have it. Yes, I do know better than all the scientists at CERN. The scientists at CERN, um, if they pay me enough money, um, I'll give them some lessons in science. I know more about science than you might think I do. And I also know a lot about sales talk than most people might think I do. So when I hear a hairy fairy story about uh, an electromagnetic uh, weapon, which is what this thing is, um, Producing black holes, I know it's not possible because a black hole is a collapsed star and made of immense mass. And it doesn't matter how fast you fire two minuscule particles at each other and collide them, they are not going to form a black hole of any description. And there it is on the news. So yes, I do know better than the scientists at CERN, unless, of course, the scientists at CERN lied to you in the first place by telling you such a ridiculous whopper. Yes, I was right. So all of you uh, people who abused me and said to me that I know nothing about science, it's time to eat humble pie.